Hi, I am Dr. Srinivas Murthy TM, an ENT consultant practicing at Ashwantpur. I practice at both Columbia Asia Referral Hospital as well as Srinivas uh, Speciality ENT Center, both of which are located in Ashwantpur. Before we actually uh, look into what exactly are the uh, signs and symptoms, let us get to know why such a thing happens. Largely, the signs um, or the symptoms of temporomandibular joint pain syndrome is produced by some problem in the dentition. That is, the patient will be having some problem with the teeth uh, or how they use the teeth. That means, the teeth will either be missing, somebody would have removed uh, a tooth for a decayed tooth or a caries tooth in the past and there is a missing tooth in the jaw or the alignment of the upper teeth and lower teeth might not be appropriate for them to effectively chew or over a period of time they might have developed uh, certain habits um, in moving the jaw in abnormal postures and grinding uh, the teeth which can cause constant stress on the joint. Other than this, there could also be a direct trauma to the joint which can lead to the joint getting inflamed. Now when the joint gets inflamed, the symptoms will spread to in and around the joint. So the patient can generally present to us with an ear pain. Most constantly it is a patient coming to us with ear pain mainly because the joint is just 2 to 3 millimeters in front of the ear and patient uh, is under the impression that the ear is um, infected or there is a problem in the ear hence they have the pain and they, many of them express surprise that we blame it on the joint when we find nothing in the ear. So as I have already explained in my previous um, uh, question, the, it's a pain syndrome. So largely uh, the patient will have pain in and around the joint. Two, as the condition progresses, it can also um, lead to what is called as subluxation of the joint that means the jaw joint comes out of its position instead of being in the joint capsule it just comes out and then uh, this is manifested by a patient hearing a clicking noise every time they open the mouth whenever they open the mouth there will be a click they hear a sound sometimes uh, the uh, there is a uh, cushion in between the two, two surfaces of the joint this can slip out of position and then the jaw will not be able to uh, close after it is opened. This is called as a lock jaw. So this is a spectrum disease wherein patient can have only pain, uh, ear symptoms like um, noise in the ear, dizziness, um, pain around the eyes, pain in the throat, pain in the neck, uh, headaches, uh, pain while chewing food, pain, pain while talking on the phone uh, or uh, sleeping onto one side on the pillow. So these are the common uh, symptoms with respect to pain which is in the early stages and as the disease progresses they can have difficulty in opening the mouth uh, or the mouth uh, the jaw getting locked or severe pain which um, will not be able to the patient will not be able to manage with regular medication.